Today we talk about David Carroll. All right, this guy's, I mean, he's been posting the same stuff over and over for like three or four years. I mean, he, he used to say some interesting things, but ever since Donald Trump won the Republican nomination, man, this guy's channel really went down the tubes. Really, I mean, I mean, he used to talk about all sorts of things. Not just this functional black woman like he likes to talk about. Now, I mean, it's pretty much the only thing he talks about now. His channel is boring as hell. Um, when Donald Trump came on the scene and won the Republican nomination, I mean, this guy cried like a baby. He cried for Ted Cruz. I mean, he said, Ted Cruz, Jeb Bush, Kasich. He said, those are the real conservatives. Man, they're all scumbags. They're all Zionist scumbags. Bush, a real conservative? Uh-uh. He's got ties to the big war machine, big corporations. He's not interested in conserving family values or any of that shit. I mean, it showed David Carroll is no expert. I mean, people call him Dr. David Carroll in the comment section. I mean, the guy's no expert, man. I mean, he cried like a baby. I mean, he, I'm not a Trump supporter either. Trump is a Zionist, neocon puppet. I think he was a big disappointment for anybody who was really thinking the guy was going to make America great again. Yeah, Trump, he, he didn't do shit. He, I mean, he talked a good game, but did nothing. I mean, Bush, he, I mean, Bush, David Carroll, that's a real conservative. And then, then he recommends to his audience that... Uh, Broad tree of logic. Uh, I mean, a Zionist shell woman, and she's also a swirler for Jew boys. Uh, tree of oh yeah, she's she's garbage, just trash. Uh, this guy's channel went and down the tubes. It really did, man. He's no intellectual juggernaut. I always thought he was a little overrated, anyway. He's no intellectual juggernaut. I mean, I've seen his grammar, too, on his Facebook page, man. <laughs> Misspelling, man. This guy is definitely not as smart as he thinks he is. I mean, Bush? Yeah, he used to talk about politics. I mean, later on, then, I remember him saying that Republicans and Democrats are plantation, which, which I totally agree. One's the House, one's the field. I totally agree with that. But he used to be a big cheerleader for the Republican Party. If you saw his ch his channel before um, before Trump came on the scene, he was a huge cheerleader. He used to fight with a lot of these Democrat uh, black channels like that New Possibilities guy. He used to oh, they used to really go at it. I mean, his channel is so boring now. It's just the same old shit, and I don't understand why people think he's so great when, when, when he's really not, man. He's really not helping. He's I remember he used to know, he used to, you know, show he knew a lot about black history and stuff, but and you don't even talk about stuff like that now. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's a few. Months ago, I tuned into one of his videos. He, I remember he was going to talk about that demographic group that cries victim more than black people do. Uh, I know which one he had in mind. I definitely know which one he had in mind. <laughs> his buddy Tree of Logic wouldn't like that. <laughs> but And uh, so uh, I emailed him for the rabbit hole video and he didn't even mention them. He didn't even mention his rabbit hole videos are the same too. Just more foul language, but I mean, just just the same shit. I don't understand why people think this guy's so good.